This is an easy, nutritious, and delicious way to eat ice cream guilt-free. Plus, for anyone that loves avocados as much as I do, it is a no-brainer. Avocados are easily my favorite superfood, packed with nearly 20 vitamins and minerals. These things are not only healthy, but really versatile. In fact, did you know that you can swap out avocados for butter or shortening in many baking recipes? Plus, they're a good source of good or unsaturated fats, making them a tasty way to be healthy, but still get tons of flavor. So you're gonna start by taking your can of coconut milk and put it in the fridge overnight. What this does is creates less work for you to use your spoon and take out all the solid coconut and what you're left with is the liquid and I love to use this to make DIY Otter Pops or popsicles. And so now I'm just gonna whip this on a medium to high speed until it's the consistency of whipped cream. Just like that. All right, so I'm just gonna set this aside and now we're gonna make our avocado cream using one and a half avocados. Good thing because I ate the other half for breakfast on my avocado toast, that's how much I love avocado. In fact, if you haven't seen that video, nine ways to make avocado toast, it will blow your mind. So I'm just gonna slice this in half. Look how great these California avocados look. Peel back the skin and pop it into my food processor. So slice the avocado one way, great. Turn it the other way, and we're creating fours. And what I love about this is a lot of times people injure themselves trying to get that pit out. They're like, hi-ya, hi-ya, that's not good. Just cut it into four pieces. Pit just pops right off. And look at that, just peel them back. Oh my gosh. Just wanna put some salt and pepper on these and eat them right now. And then I'm just gonna add a little bit of a lemon for acidity, but it really helps the avocado from oxidizing and turning brown when we freeze it. And now I'm just gonna turn this on and what we're looking for is a silky smooth puree. And then be sure to scrape down the sides so you can get all the avocado nice and smooth. One more time. Awesome, I don't know if I'm craving ice cream or guacamole right now. So now I'm just gonna take our avocado cream and carefully fold it into our coconut cream. We're making avocado ice cream with four ingredients. How crazy is this? And this is perfect for all my vegan friends. This is really looking nice. Now we're gonna add our organic brown rice syrup. This is a great sweetener that's low in fructose. If you've never used it before, really awesome. I'm just gonna fold this in, again, really gently, get it all incorporated, and that is it. Now I'm just gonna transfer it into my freezer safe container, and then put it in the freezer for at least four hours, but before I do that, I'm just gonna cover it with some plastic wrap. This is gonna prevent ice from forming on top of the ice cream, which we don't want. And then push that plastic wrap right against the ice cream. Yay, I can hardly wait. Mmm, this looks so good. Mmm, mmm. It's creamy, it's silky. You get the flavor of the avocado, but then the sweetness from the coconut. Plus, this is a really great recipe to give to kids. It's a fun way to introduce healthy, sweet snacks into their diet. So, are you gonna try this recipe? I would love to know. Let me know in the comment box below if you have any other ideas for sweet avocado desserts. And give us some love, subscribe, and hit that thumbs up button. I'm Brandy, and I'll see you next time on Eat the Trend.